I'm going to attend Maryland University. Uh, what went into the decision to become a Terrapin? Uh, um, I mean, when they offered me, you know, I put some thought into it. You know, I've always been a, like, a Merlin, Merlin fan, home. It's my hometown, and, like, I started thinking more about it when I started looking to the roster and, like, who's going there. Like, one of my good, good friends, Rod Peters, he's going there, and, like, I just think I'll be able to play good with him. I've seen Turgeon recruiting at a lot of WCAC games. Have you seen him quite a bit during the season? Uh, yes, I have seen him run play, but I've seen them when they played Kentucky. I've seen when they played Moya State. And I've been to a game when they played um, Lafayette. How, what do you think of the College Park campus? How do you see yourself fitting in there? I mean, I see myself fitting in real good, you know. You play basketball, everybody's going to love you. What about the, uh, the uniforms? The football team's had some interesting <laughs> ones, do you think? I think for basketball, they're going to be rolling out yeah. some interesting ones. Yeah. What are your I like, thoughts on that? I like flashy stuff, so, you know, good uniforms fit me. And do you believe that you guys can can uh, help bring back a national championship yes. to College Park? Yes, Because yes. we got Merlin players, so we can bring it back. Merlin got the best talent. Fair to Turtle. How do you see Melo fitting in with Maryland and uh, with Turgeon there? You know, I think one thing you want for your players is you want them to go where they're really wanted. Um, Coach Turgeon has been in our gym you know, uh, three times this fall alone, we've talked on the phone, uh, and the assistant Delante has been here, and you can see in in, in his reactions and his talking to me, I can see how excited he is for Mello to come there and be a part of things. So I think you want that for your players. Um, you want to see them do really well, and you want to see them um, be in a, in a good situation for them. So I think that's really exciting, um, and I I'm kind of excited because I think Coach Turgeon saw all the things that I see in Melo, that he, he just keeps getting better because he listens, he's coachable, he loves to be in the gym. Um, and I and I think this, he's made a pretty good transition to the point. I mean, last year he played the two all the time, and that's been really good for our team. They're always proud when a guy can get the perfect fit for him. Um, the thing I really like is I think when Melo came here um, as a young player, he was considered good, but all he's done is made himself better. And, and that's a, you know, all credit to him and, and the level-headedness of his mom. She's just, she's the best. And just every time she'd say, just keep working. You know, he's our leading scorer as a freshman. Just keep working. And so couldn't be more proud of him as a young man. Great. Thanks. For DCSportsFan.com, I'm Brian Kapoor.